Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Nikhil. In this video, I am going to explain you how to create a search uh, button or you can say how to implement a search in Laravel 8. So for that, I need to create a form. I have a URL with display data that is going, that is displaying the data from the back end. So I'm going to just create a form over here in the display blade.php file. I'm going to create a form. Let it be. To the form action, I can define here as a URL. And in the URL, I will be giving here as search record. So this is the URL that I have been defined. And to this method, to this form method, I can define here as post so that my values should be uh, moving in a safely manner. So I can define here as slash instead of uh, to search, a, uh, to create a URL. So URL is a property or uh, you can say URL is a property of a Laravel. In this way, you can define a URL. And here I have to specify a token that is CSRF underscore field. That is mandatory. If any form is being created in Laravel, this token is mandatory to implement in your input type text name equals to name and I need one input type submit in order to submit my form value so I can put its name as search and this is my form that will be created in your display data so this is my form and if I'm going to right click it inspect element then it has a form action that will that is going to take me to the search record URL and it has a method post so this is a token variable that has given a unique ID to my this form and input type text the name is name and input type submit the value is search. So moving to the web.php I need to create a root over here so root post because form method is post and I can say here as search search record because the URL which I have mentioned here is the search record and the comma and then I am going to specify here the method name by opening this URL in your uh, address bar of the browser it is going to take me to the search method in the i controller so in i controller I will be creating so this is my so here the form action will be taking me to the this URL search record URL with the help of method post and I have created a post URL over here and here the search record variable that is I have been mentioned and uh, uh, the, on which on the I controller it is going to, on the search method so I controller it I uh, in the search method it will be coming so I can define here as public function search and as uh, I have known that form has been submitted so I will declare a request object and here I am going to check if request is method. So if a request method is post and then it means the form has been submitted. I am going to pick up the name value. So with the help of request object, I am going to get the value of text box. To text box, I have defined the name as name. So I have written here as request get name and here I am going to get my data with the help of student model and with the help of student model I will be implementing a where clause. Uh, so I have a field name called first name and comma and I will be implementing the like query and now uh, the percentage whatever the user will be searching uh, it can be uh, your name either the name has a value of ABC uh, so ABC on any of the uh, word that is uh, if the word contains ABC in front it will also search that word and if it if it contains ABC at the end uh, that will that will also be picked up so here my query goes student 
then student is a model that is cons that is associated with my student table so it will be finding uh, so where clause it's a where query it will be searching the first name like means where the first name field value will be like whatever the user has given in the query that i have picked in my name variable so if user has written abc so any word that has a abc written on the front or abc written on the back that all words will be searched or my abc is in between any word so that all will be searched and the data will be transferred to data variable so after that i am going to return a view uh, that is a display view uh, the which one the view that is going to be display because i need to filter out values here only so display view will be rendering and it will be receiving data i will be converting into the array so compact data so here it is been returned so let's check with the like implementation it's implementation so there is a error and uh, we can say here as so here comes the error uh, let's look into your web.php file so root po route post and i have not put a semicolon over here so display data so here my the form comes so if i'm going to search here as abc and if i'm going to click on the search button so my values are being uh, like filtered the it is showing me the the table is showing me the record that contains only abc if i'm going to write here as ab that in that case also uh, it has been searched if i am searching here as hn so hn uh, is the last characters in my john word so that will also be searched so in this way you can just find out your uh, the records so i am going to explain a quick about this thing so first of all we have created a form that contains my url it will be going whenever the form will be submitted it will be going taking me to the search record url so it has a csrr field and the method post and input type text with the name name and in the web.php i have created a root variable as uh, root as post because method is post so search record search record is the url which is going to be passed and it will be going meet uh, it is going to take me to the i controller search method so i controller search method uh, when the form is been posted from here the values will be received by this request uh, object and if the request is method post means it is validating that if it contains if the form has been submitted then i have a input type text with the name name so that value will be picked and will be transferred to name variable and in the student with the help of student model in the where clause the first name which is like name the all the data will be fetched and the return to the data variable and in, after that i am going to send that variable in the display and here the data variable will be uh is the for each loop will be implemented over here and uh, one by one the data is be, is being picked and like uh, transferred to the row variable and in this way you can just print out your data you can just print out your search data onto your user screen so this was all about the search record how to search uh, how to implement a search in your laravel if hope you like my video if you like my video do subscribe to my channel and like and share my videos and do click on the notification button to get all the latest updates of tech tutorials and programming languages thanks for watching my video